Today, Diana and I are going to be driving from Odessa, Texas down to San Antonio. Is that right, babe? Yep. San Antonio, Texas to do a Christmas light boat parade on their river walk. So this is a great opportunity and the first opportunity where the truck is completely empty with exception of our some of our luggage and stuff to stay over down there but to see what kind of gas mileage or fuel mileage the truck will get after it's been tuned. Okay, just filled up full tank of diesel, extra expensive, 329. Well, I guess that's not as bad as like California or anything, but uh, so full tank of diesel. I'm gonna set the, reset the odometer or the tripometer. So right now it's at 18.6 miles per gallon, uh, only at 15 miles. Uh, that's because I used my keyless start this morning. And I do it often just to let the engine warm up. Here we go, zero it out. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, so we've been driving for 37.8 miles and a small hindrance on the fuel economy is there's been a slight progressive grade up until this point actually, and a little bit of a headwind. That might not seem like much, but I do have a canopy and the canopy sits just a little bit taller than the cab of the truck and so I, I feel like it catches some wind there. Um, and then also another hindrance is uh, their speed limit here is 75 miles an hour. I just am now just chugging along by behind a motorhome, so I'm doing 60. And those, those few things have made a huge impact in whether or not I get good gas mileage. The, the headwind, the slight, a tiny, tiny grade, and then also the canopy, um, and then the speed limit. But right now, I'm at 26.3 miles per gallon. I've been slowly creeping up on that. I'll go ahead and show you guys the tachometer here. If you want to bring this over here, babe. The odometer, you mean? Well, this one's the tack. It shows all the, all the goods. It's really hard to see because I think the sun's glaring. Um, but just take a look here for just a second on all the different, all the different numbers. Uh, you can see that the soot has one gram. Not really. Not really. Um, but everything else is looking really solid. This does hit more boost on the upper right hand corner with the uh, the tune. Before I think max towing going uphill with my foot in it, the highest I had seen was maybe 37, 38 PSI. Um, and then this thing is completely empty and so if I was really trying to take off I think it can hit 42 pretty easily. So this again only has the 10 horsepower tow tune with the tune for the transmission for towing as well. So this isn't even the economy tune, this is just straight tow tune. And so I don't know if that makes a big difference. So anyway, it's creeping up a little bit, 26.6 now. It's doing good. All right, so we had to stop for some grub. We're in the middle of nowhere. Uh, we got some Subway. Um, so I'm not getting as good as gas mileage as I was hoping because the road's 80 miles an hour, but traffic's moving at 85, 90. So 85, 90 miles an hour, the truck's at like 2,100 RPMs while I'm driving. Sorry. <clears throat> and so I'm still averaging though, like 25 and a half miles per gallon. I was hoping to break 30, but 90 miles an hour, it's really hard to do. But I'm actually really impressed with what kind of mileage I'm still getting at 85 to 90 miles an hour. So I'll keep you guys posted. Now that I'm driving at 75 miles an hour, it's actually increased my fuel economy a little bit. I'm at 25.5 miles per gallon. It got me, I went clear down to at almost 24, um, going up and down some grades and maintaining that 80 to 90 mile an hour range, depending on what traffic is doing. I wasn't too impressed with the 24 miles an hour or 24 miles per gallon, but I guess this is a four wheel drive pickup, the four door long box with a canopy on the back. So that is still pretty good to considering all of that. The best I ever got was a half hour drive between Midland and Odessa. i have done that a few times and I got 35 and a half or 36 miles per gallon, which is really good. But that speed limit right there is about 55 to 60. I think for a short period it hits 65, but that's it. So that's the update. We're 318 miles in, and uh, I guess I'll do one final closer once we get there, and then maybe one final closer once we get home the next day to see if there's any difference.
So we are getting ready to leave San Antonio. I haven't reset the odometer or anything like that. So the distance was 355 miles and I got an average of 26 miles per gallon. And that was at primarily 80, 85 miles an hour all the way here for the 355 miles. It was only at the very end that we hit the 65 to 75 mile an hour range. So the truck did really well. I'm gonna reset it and then um, going right from here all the way back and we'll see if I get the same numbers. He sneezed. Forty-seven miles 24.5 miles per gallon truck did fantastic i did see the boost hit 43 psi one time maybe twice and i was in it i was just driving normal on the way down i think i was trying to baby it to see what, what kind of mileage i could get once i understood that everyone's moving at like 90 miles an hour and i didn't want to hold up traffic i was just like forget it i'm just gonna drive like everyone else and how I normally would without trying to conserve fuel. And so I ended up with 24.5, but that's really impressive. Um, I would say it was 90 was the top uh, miles per hour and I sustained that for several hours. And then on the lower side, it was 80. And then the last probably 45 minutes was about 70, 75. So does pretty dang good for the tune.